Only you can prevent forest fires. You can probably recognize this famous phrase by Smokey Bear, a message from the U.S. Forest Service that has reminded families since the 1940s to be mindful while out in nature. As dated and cheesy as the phrase is, it's actually more true now than ever before. Science shows us that wildfires are getting stronger and more frequent all around the world. And it's becoming clear that climate change is the cause. Wildfires are devastatingly violent, capable of destroying entire habitats and communities. Look no further than the most recent major wildfires in the United States. In California, wildfires burned more than 3.4 million acres, and the resulting smoke in the atmosphere created some really unsettling imagery. Fires in Oregon destroyed about 1 million acres and displaced hundreds from their homes, while fires in Washington scorched more than 800,000 acres. Outside of the U.S., wildfires threaten major rainforests, critical wetlands, and even forests in the Arctic. In Australia, an estimated 46 million acres were burned after a devastating bushfire season in 2019. A number of factors influence wildfires, including temperature, soil moisture, and what's known as forest fuels. Forest fuels are any type of organic matter that can burn and spread wildfires like trees, grasses, shrubs, and logs. Climate change doesn't spark the tinder that rises to a wildfire. In fact, in the US, more than 80% of all wildfires are man-made. Instead, climate change creates warmer and drier conditions that increase the likelihood of fires and their potency. Global temperatures have been rising steadily as greenhouse gas emissions accumulate in the atmosphere, disrupting precipitation patterns in ways that create more droughts. This dynamic ultimately feeds itself. Just as climate change intensifies wildfires, wildfires intensify climate change. Forests are carbon sinks, which means they absorb enormous amounts of carbon dioxide from the air. But as trees burn, they both release carbon and become unable to store more carbon. If we can't end this cycle, we put the planet at an even bigger risk. The loss of rainforests, wetlands, and other ecosystems destroys the very biodiversity that humanity depends upon for its own survival. While leaders and governments should consider everything they can to mitigate the risk of spreading fires, climate change is an existential risk that cannot be ignored. Unless greenhouse gas emissions are curbed in the years ahead, wildfires are likely to keep getting worse. So take action with Global Citizen to petition world leaders and governments to address climate change and reduce greenhouse gas emissions. Because only we can prevent our forests and our future from burning up in the smoke.